Good morning, APAC. David and Goliath, the original underdog story. A plucky young warrior defeats a giant with only his staff, a sling, and a handful of stones. That story reminds us that with courage and faith, we can overcome any odds. Today, the state of Israel is a modern day David, and Goliath is the arsenal of hundreds of thousands of rockets and missiles aimed at the Jewish state by terror groups like Hezbollah and Hamas. But this time, Israel has a major upgrade in technology that will help it take down the next giant. <laughs> Amen. The David Sling Missile Defense System, which was co-developed by Israel's Raphael Advanced Defense Systems and the American defense contractor Raytheon. When it goes online, when it goes online later this year, David Sling will play a critical role in Israel's missile defense network. While Iron Dome has proven effective at intercepting the short-range rockets, David Sling safeguards Israelis from medium-range ballistic missiles, long-range artillery rockets, drones, and cruise missiles. That is, simply put, a game changer. Israel's Home Front Command estimates that during a conflict, Hezbollah could fire more than 1,000 rockets a day into Israel's north. A comprehensive multi-tiered missile defense system ensures that both civilians and critical infrastructure are protected from the full spectrum of attacks. The system more than triples the range of Iron Dome and deploys in a variety of settings, giving civilians critical protections in areas of the country outside the umbrella of Iron Dome batteries. And as a supporter of a close U.S.-Israel alliance, I couldn't be more proud that a crucial component of the David Sling missile, the Stunner Interceptor, was developed by Raytheon in my district in Tucson, Arizona. Do you know the United States has committed $1.1 billion in research and development funding for the David Sling system over the past decade? As co-developers of this project, we gain valuable insight into technology that improves our own systems, and it keeps Americans safe, too. As a retired Air Force colonel and an A-10 Warthog pilot, that's the plane I flew right there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And as someone who deployed to the Middle East and Afghanistan six times, and as a member of the House Armed Services Committee and the Homeland Security Committee, I've dedicated my life to protecting our country and ensuring a safer world for our allies. Thank you. That's why, and that's why I am a proud and vocal supporter of U.S. security assistance to Israel. Our partnership with Israel ensures American interests in the Middle East are protected by our friend who shares our commitment to democracy and human rights. And U.S. annual security assistance to Israel, which you all advocate for, comp comprises a significant portion of Israel's defense budget. In addition to that, the U.S. Missile Defense Agency works with their Israeli counterparts to ensure that the Jewish state purchases missile defense technology built right here in America to keep its citizens safe and secure. Those purchases add up. Raytheon, in my district, employs about 10,000 people in Tucson and works with more than 500 suppliers across the state. And Israeli purchases contribute to a major portion of the $2.1 billion economic impact that Raytheon brings to Arizona each year. If Israel is a modern-day David, I'm glad to know that my district and my state play a crucial role in ensuring that our hero comes to the fight better equipped than ever before. Because David Sling helps Arizona develop new technologies, they boost our economy, and they keep 
all our citizens safe and secure. And that's Israel in my state. Thank you all. God bless you.